And now presenting our sensational Stephen Campbell. Hello all. Um, look, it's a pleasure to be here, although I wish we didn't have to be here. I wish this sort of thing should never have risen in this state, in this country, in this world. Unfortunately, uh, look, I should introduce myself. I'm Steve Campbell. I'm the uh, State Secretary of the Democratic Labor Party. The right one. <laughs> one of the things I was very glad to hear... Oh, OK, sorry. Uh, one of the things I was very pleased to hear um, was that the Liberal Party is committed to getting rid of this and other programs. I think they'll be guaranteed in getting a lot of support because of that. I think they know that. One of the things, though, as far as the, the DLP is concerned, you want to get rid of these programs, you don't just get rid of them, you need to purge the system. This goes a lot deeper than a title or a few people in a few schools just saying a few things that we are not happy with. What we need to do is actually get out there. It's a bit like... Somebody who goes out there and pours toxic waste on the soil. You can't grow anything good in it. If you grow anything out of it, the fruits are going to be bad and we're all going to get sick out of it. What you need to do is you need to get... You, first of all, you need to stop that poison being poured on the soil. You then need to purge that soil, cleanse it, get it back to the condition it should be for good fruit to grow. Then you make sure nobody who manufactured, supplied, or spread that has anything to do with that soil again. And that's what we need to do. Yeah. Now, as the Secretary of a Labor Party, and I know a lot of people are inclined when you say that to spit, but as the Secretary of a Labor Party, it disgusts me that the people in here who call themselves the government actually refer to themselves as a Labor Party. A Labor Party supports families, children, workers, communities. We, as far as we are concerned, we are Labor. We are Labor. Labor, DLP. That is it. Look for that. Remember that name. We are Labor. Don't be afraid to take a name back. If they call themselves Christian, would you give it up to them? No. You take it back. We take Labor back from them because, quite frankly, call them what they are. They are communists. Yeah. This bunch of socialists, actually, actually, come on, more than that, they're not just socialists, they're sociopaths. You cannot reason with a sociopath. You get rid of them. We have got no more important task this year than to remove these people, take our house back. And this mob over here, the Liberal Party, need to fight tooth and nail to get that house yeah. back. Yeah. I tell you what, I would like the D DLP, Democratic Labor, to be the government, but I don't think we're going to make it this time. Yeah. But what we will do is, our job is not to get the Liberal Party in, that's their job. Our job is to get this ALP communist government out. Yeah. We need to take back everything in this state. Our education is vital. It affects our children. They are out. Look, there is no accident in this. Indoctrinate the children, you get them for life. That is an old communist idea. Yeah. Yeah. That's what they are doing. That is what we have to stop. They're our kids. Nothing should, should stand in our way of protecting these kids. So when it comes to... They are. They are ours. They are not theirs. They have... Keep your hands off our kids, Daniel Andrews. I'll keep, it, I'll keep it short now, because quite frankly, you've stood in a fairly warm condition, you've been patient, you've loved being here, but you wish to God you never had to be. So as far as we're concerned, as far as the DLP is concerned, we are committed to getting rid of this group. We will do whatever we can to get rid of this group, getting decent people in, and we will support anybody, upper or lower house, who is standing for the right thing. We will get our own people in, we will get other people in. Look. There's a lovely man in the audience here, Harry Truman, his name is. I know. It's just like the president. And I said to him, I have an old motto that I, I live by. I have it on my desk. And my, the motto I go by is, it's amazing what you can accomplish if you don't care who gets the credit. Yeah. 
The GLP will do it, but I'm happy for anybody else to do it. If nobody wants to come and kick this lot out, go and do it. We'll back them. You all need to back them as well. That's your commitment. You need to be pushing this. You need to do as much as possible. You need to make sure this is not just an election coming up. This is a crusade. You need to be convicted. Andrew's out, absolutely. Andrew's out. Andrew's out. Now, one of the things, as, some of our, as one of the DLP people has tried to remind me, when you go and have a look on that ballot paper in November, you have a look for Labor. Actually, look to vote for Labor. Because the DLP, who has been determined by the court system here to be the legitimate Labor Party, we have won the right to appear as Labor on the ballot paper. You go and look for Labor, L-A-B-O, you are. The one that puts you back into Labor. We intend to take this back, we intend to fight, get rid of this, and as far God willing, we will keep them out from now on. We don't want a Communist Party back in, and that is what they are. If they were in any way a Labor Party, we might have sympathy for them, but they are not. So quite frankly, no sympathy for them, no mercy for them on election day. Get rid of them. You've got people out there that will do the right Australian Country Party. You've got other parties that are out there that will support and stand beside the DLP and doing the right thing. Now, this isn't a political rally, but it sort of is in that we are standing up for a principle and we're standing up for something that, quite frankly, we should never have ever lost. It is a principle and a right that should never have been lost in this state and we need to demonstrate to everybody else in this country that we're stopping it here, we're not letting it go on, it's never going to come back, they don't have to have it either. There are great programs around the world. There's some terrific programs around the world. If you're just talking about anti-bullying, there's some great ones. I think yeah. there's a well-known one that's been mentioned in Parliament. I know Rachel's brought it up. Uh, the DLP's run with it. The Ruler Program from Yale University. Have a look at it. R-U-L-E-R. Yale University. Great, great anti-bullying program. That's what you want. Yeah. Not something that exploits our children. Yeah. Something that treats them with dignity and equality. And when you're talking about bullying, everything in bullying needs to be dealt with. Not just something that exploits our children, twists them and indoctrinates them so they're told to vote a particular way or to feel in some way that they're not worth living in their own body. So look, I'm not going to keep you much longer. I just basically sim simply want to say it is great to see you here. I wish we didn't have to do it, but as far as I'm concerned, Every one of us has a duty now, we've done our relevant, we've been here, every one of us has a duty to go out and do something about it. Yeah. 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 Just, and I'm going to tell you, so I think if somebody's got a, holding one of the pamphlets up there, just to let you know, that deal, in about a month's time, they're handing the pamphlets out, the DLP has got uh, a forum, it's a lunch on, it's regarding education, Dr Kevin Donnelly, that marvellous and wonderful Dr Kevin Donnelly from the ACU will be the guest speaker. Every cent raised is not going to the DLP for our funds, we'll, we'll need that and we'll fight on, and it's going to a charity. So have a look at those pamphlets, help us support this fight to bring education back to what it's supposed to be, yeah. educating and enlightening our children. Yeah. So look, God bless you all for doing everything and being so wonderful. And I am so looking forward to, even though you mightn't be at the celebratory, uh, at, the, at the Liberal Party celebration for winning government or the DLP celebration for getting members in and getting this lot out, I want every one of you on election night to have a party for getting this lot out. Yeah. God bless you. This has been an Unshackled Fast. Please like, comment and subscribe. While you're here, grab our free ebook at theunshackledbattlefield.net and visit theunshackled.net for all the latest news and commentary.